everybody. This is Cindy Utter. Welcome to my artsy endeavors. Have fun. Hey guys, guess what time it is? Large Marge in charge. Um, today it is Patricia. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Hold on, hold on. I want to make sure I see a name right. Patricia Stubbs. This is um, her package of goodies that she sent for me for Large Marge. I've picked out a few things here. I love this napkin. Isn't that beautiful? Absolutely love it. Love these flowers and this card stock. Okay, so what we're going to do, that's what I'm going to be using today. We got to get Marge settled down here so she calms down a little bit. Let's see if we can. Okay, I'm not worried about that. <coughs> Pardon me. Okay, so my thought is I want to do this. I like this bag here. And I want to use these napkins, so I am going to get out my matte medium, maybe, alright, let's get out the matte medium and I want to start off by putting these birdies down, I like these birdies, They're so cool. I apologize I keep coughing guys I am still sick my husband is still sick we've been sick for seems like forever now um, hopefully someday it'll stop but right now we're dealing with it so These, this napkin is so pretty I normally don't use a whole lot of napkins because I find them kind of difficult at times because I'm quite rough with um, putting them on, but I found that if I take it easy a little bit and just go lighter on them, they're not—it's not so bad. So let's grab a brush. We're gonna take some of our matte medium. Now I've had some people say, um, ask me if it's awkward working in this book. So far, not really. Um, it's not, you know, something I can deal with. It's no big deal. As it gets fuller, yeah, it's gonna be, it's gonna be a challenge. But you know what? That's okay. Well, I'm up for a challenge. I prefer things to be challenging than easy. See, now I've got to learn. I got to be careful when I do this. Pretty. I love it. All right, so here is, I'm going to put that there. I'm going to set this aside to dry a little bit. And then what I want to do is I want to take this piece of cardstock that she sent to me, which is a nice size. I'm going to cut it down just a little bit. Because I want it to fit in that bag, which that's going to work. And now we're going to make a tag out of this. So the first thing I'm going to do is use some music. I know, um, not very chatty this morning. I'm, uh, like I said, I still don't feel the greatest. This pneumonia is holding on and it's not letting go very easy. So, let's see. 
a little bit right here. All right. Just cover the whole thing with a good coat of matte medium. <coughs> Okay, now I want, I thought this napkin was absolutely stunning too, so let's use this and use it like this. My hubs is coming. He's been working on his train set, so he's coming in to hang out, I believe. Maybe, maybe not. Funny, I say where I want to put it, and then I put it somewhere totally opposite. <laughs> Pardon me, I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. I don't mean to be coughing and gagging through these whole videos. But such is the life. I am liking, liking, liking. Okay, now. Do I want this other piece? I want, okay, I want to do the greenery. So we're going to take. Let's see what we're going to do here. I want some of this. Don't want all of it. I do want some of it. And it's going to go right here. My lungs are still full of crap. Feels like I can feel them um, like when I wheeze. But that's okay. I go back to my doctor's on Tuesday. I'll talk to him and tell him it's still here. It hasn't went away. Liking this. I'm going to put it here though. Perfect. Alright, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to dry this up really quick. And we'll be right back. Alright guys, um, I set this aside to dry for a few minutes until I decide what else I'm going to do with it. Um, and I've got the paper bag here that I did this on the one side and I can't move this over because my matte medium is right there. But I'm going to put this one on this side because I like how it looks. I like how it looks against that paper bag. So we're just going to use some matte medium. And we're going to put her down. back over. Get some matte medium down on it. And then we'll let this one dry. And then I'm going to work on that tag. I'm going to use the tag in this bag. So I've got to find some other 
goodies to put on to it. So we will do that. These napkins are just so pretty. Thank you, Patricia. I really appreciate you sending me the goodies to put into Marge. So, all right. Let me grab some other goodies for the tag. We'll let that dry. And I'll be right back. <coughs> okay, so I got a couple different things out. Um, I found this little butterfly that I had in my stash. And I think he looks really cool on here. So we're going to take him and glue him down. I just think he looks cool. Yay! And then I'm going to take, this is a flower that I had drawn, I don't know, eons ago in an old book. And I like that, so I'm going to put that down here. Oops. Don't ask me why I'm using tacky glue, I don't know. It's what I picked up. You could use Elmer's, you could use, you know, school glue, you can use a glue stick. Whatever you have available. guys. <laughs> this is my... Now thinking about this, I'm thinking I probably should do the other side too. So I'm going to have to let this dry really good and then we're going to do up the other side. So I'll be right back. Alright, so we've got the back side here and this is... Um, <coughs> another napkin that Patricia sent in the goodie pack. So I'm going to use that here on the back side. So pretty, aren't they? And then I'm just going to make sure I lay it down, make sure it all gets coated good and I don't tear it. this dry. I'm going to make this, this is going to be a tag, but it's going to made, be made a little bit differently. So I've got to grab some fibers that I want to use and we'll do that while this dries and I'll be right back. Okay, so I have this box of words that um, whenever I have magazines or newspapers or whatever that I see that has words on it, I cut them out and stick them in here. Okay. Um, so I picked out a couple words and they really, you know, it's not something that makes a whole lot of sense, but hey, it works for me. So what I'm going to do is I'm, I put the bird down on this side. I got, are you ready to play? So I'm actually going to take this and this I'm going to tape on. I'm just using some double sided tape here. I just thought that was kind of cool. Are you ready to play? I'm ready to play. So here's this. And then, of course, the to play. back side Oops. okay we'll put that there for right now 
Now on the back side, I did take this little bird and I glued him down. And then, I don't know why, but I just, I like this, the new easy. So new easy is going to go here. Again, I'm going to tape it. Um, I just think it'll stay better that way. Okay, so we're going to tape those. I told you it was going to be a tag, but it's going to be a little bit different. So what I'm going to do is I've got my punch here, and I have some fibers. These are just some random fibers that I had in a um, in a box. I'm going to figure out which side I want to be the front. We're going to do some decorating on these two. And what I'm going to do is poke some holes. take these fibers and we're just going to mess around getting some fibers put on here. Let's start with the black and maybe the gold. Let's start with the black. Again, a little bit of the gold. <coughs> Just a little bit, not a lot. Just something to give it a little pop of color. Like that. Oh, this is a braided gold. Oops. for that, so I'll hang on to that. <coughs> and okay. So there's two and let's do the third one. And again I'm just gonna use the black. And then just tie it here in the hole. Partial black. Okay. Now, when this actually goes in the book, um, I'll be able to bring it up out like this. So, my plan is for it to be right here. And it's going to be in the page just like that. But before we do that, we still got some more work to do to it. So let's see. Just playing around. Probably throw some dots down. You know how I like my dots. Give it a little bit of something more. Just to kind of wake it up a little bit. Okay.
So there's not really a whole lot you have to do that. That's a cute little tag. Alright, now the back side. When you're doing stuff like this, don't be afraid to use your Sharpies. Sharpies are one of the easiest pens, first of all, to, they're, they're affordable. Um, second of all, they're one of the easiest pens to make a permanent mark that's going to stick. Um, and you don't have to worry about what you're going to write over with them because they go over pretty much anything. So, I love my king size Sharpie. A lot of fun with that. Alright, so him I'm not going to do anything else to other than give him an eye. Alright. Hmm, let's see, should I do something? Let's take purple. Um, this is a deco color acrylic paint marker in purple. I want to bring out some more of that purple because I got the purple right here in the butterfly. Well, it's kind of hard to see it, but it's right here. Okay, so here's my little birdie guy. The new easy. Are you ready to play? Let that dry a little bit. Now, what are we going to do with these guys? I like the way it is. I think the only thing I'm going to do is add a little bit of either um, probably gold to the outside. Let me grab that. I'll be right back. Alright, so I actually pulled out some uh, metallic gelatos to use. And I'm just going to basically go around this with the different colors. This one is... Um, Iced chai. And look how dry. <laughs> I'd say my ink wasn't dry, what would you say? <laughs> oh well, it happens. I'm just going to put a little bit of this. Just give it a little bit of here, pop of color here. Yeah, I like that. I like it. Now let's go this side. Same thing. A little bit of that on. Put a little bit of this ice chai on. And then we'll go back in with a pop of color again. Just stir it down a little bit of this color. Okay. Now I'm not going to do a whole lot more to those because I really like just the way they are right now. So, next thing we're going to do is we're going to take our tag. And she's going to go right in here. And Patricia, there you go. I have a nice little page package done for your mail. 
Um, thank you very much. I really appreciate it. I had a lot of fun putting this together. And she's all set. So I hope you guys enjoyed. We'll talk to you soon. Bye. Hey everybody, I hope you enjoyed that video. As always, hit like, share, comment. I'll answer any of the comments that you have or questions. Um, and as always, be kind, have fun, that's what life's all about, and happy creating. We'll talk to you soon. Bye!